this is Gluten Free with Bree and DJ. I'm Bree. This I'm is DJ. DJ. There we go. You finally introduced <laughs> yourself. And today we are reviewing a local brand to us. We live on Long Island called Terra Nut. Um, they sent us a few packages of their goodies. They're kind of like snacks. So the first time I actually heard about this company was on Halloween. My dad brought me home a little... Uh, candy. I considered it a candy on Halloween, um, so I could have something because I really didn't have any candy. But didn't he like find this guy at, like the bank or something? No, he was at the doctor. Oh, he was okay. at the chiropractor's office, and they had these there, and he was talking to whoever it was and whatever. So that's the first time I tried them. They were pretty good, so they sent us over some stuff to review. He's never tried them, um, and that's it. We'll hop right in. So I'll start with this one because. I accidentally ate both of these <laughs> without realizing like that I should have saved one for the review. I just like, I don't know, I was just making a smoothie bowl and they both ended up in there and so he's not going to get to try it, but I will tell you that the peanut one... That is so rude. I know. What if it's the best one? What is it? Peanut. Mm -hmm. Was delicious and it's perfect for a smoothie bowl. I actually spoke to, I don't know if it was the owner or just somebody on the team at Terra Nut, but they gave me like a few ways to play around with this. So they said like smoothie bowls, they sit on top of sweet potatoes, which was interesting, but it would probably be really, really good. Um, and they gave a few other options, but I definitely have to try the sweet potatoes. So peanut, I'm sorry, I tried it all. <laughs> I will give you the ingredients. So we have peanuts, oats, and organic coconut nectar. Simple ingredients. Um, and these are, where can I find all the allergens? There's all plant, so they're vegan. There's no gluten, no dairy. And this one has is refined sugar free. So really good. Which one do you want to try first? Since I tried that one. Um, I want to try the acai one. No, this is the paleo punch with acai. Um, the interesting thing about this one is that it has raw sugar cane, which I don't know why they didn't just do coconut sugar and make it like really paleo but it is what it is so the ingredients brazil nuts cashews flax seeds almonds walnuts acai berries coconut stevia leaves leaves <laughs> stevia leaves spirulina and raw sugar cane so let's give it a try you have this one no no you have one oh. they come in these little packages whoa Whoa. It's the acai. The acai makes it a weird color. So this is what it looks like. Definitely not what I was expecting, but it's not bad. I was expecting it not to look like this. <laughs> <laughs> so the look was different in your head. So I kind of knew what they looked like because I had the peanut one and the other one on Halloween, but this one is a different color. We'll show you the nut one, but when you open it, it'll probably be more brown, where this is a little, like, purplish-grayish. I don't know, it's a weird color, but the taste is good. It tastes like nuts, and... It's got, some... like, a chewy... You can tell, like, it's a berry. Yeah, yeah. I will say one thing. They are a little crumbly. Crumbly. I don't know if I said that with a weird accent the first time. <laughs> they are a little crumbly. Yeah. Is that even a word? Crumbly, maybe. They crumble. <laughs> How about that? Um, so like, I, I wouldn't eat this if I was driving in the car because I do tend to snack in the car sometimes, but this would just be <laughs> everywhere. So just to keep in mind, other than that, taste is good. I thought there, like, I knew there wasn't oats in here from the ingredients, but it kind of tastes like there's oats in here. So mm -hmm. it's good. The next one is the nut punch. So the ingredients in this one, Almonds, cashews, walnuts, Brazil nuts, peanuts, oats, flax seeds, spirulina, and organic coconut nectar. Again, gluten-free, plant-based, non-GMO. And on the side, it says fuel to go or in smoothies and salads. Mm. I could see it in the salad too. I like nuts in my salad, like some different texture. So I'd probably put this in there. Yeah, that's the color of the peanut one was. More brown, looks like nuts. Mashed up nuts.
Tastes like the peanut one. Yeah. Well, I, don't, I never had it, but it <laughs> tastes like peanuts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it has peanuts. This just tastes like chunky peanut butter. Mm -hmm. And it gets creamy. He's like, it really does taste like chunky peanut butter, but in like a shape. <laughs> <laughs> um, the peanuts are strong in that, but I like that. The only difference with this one is it only had peanuts. This one has some other almonds. I mean, some other nuts. But I tried this one a few weeks ago. And from what I can remember, these taste pretty much the same. But I could be a little off because it was a few weeks ago. But I like this. Again, wouldn't eat it while I'm driving. It is going to make a little bit of a mess. But this on like a nice like baked sweet potato like crumbled on there maybe like a little bit of honey or something like that probably be good. yeah i was thinking that they sh should definitely be like not coated in honey but there should be honey in there i feel like that would go they, really yeah, well if they sweetened one with honey it'd probably be great yeah like rather than the coconut make it like a candy yeah yeah they're not like candies but they're not snacks like i considered it a candy on halloween because it was like it was in that wrapper you saw what it looked like like that looks like a little candy on halloween um but that's really it. This company, like I said, I like that their products are made in the USA. That's exciting. Good for you. Um, and <laughs> they're local to us on Long Island. You can buy them online. If you're on Long Island, they're often at like farmer's markets and stuff like that, or a random chiropractor's office where my dad found it. Um, <laughs> and yeah, find them online if you're interested. And great job by Tearing Up for creating these little snacks on the go. They're very tasty, and I'll definitely could see myself eating these. We have a lot more to go, so <laughs> we'll be eating them.